Yeah. Show what up, R&B. Good morning, everybody. I know that we owe you an update. It's been like two weeks and you have heard radio silence from us. So I just wanted to hop in and record this quick intro to the video that I am about to upload. Um, we are behind schedule and it's just simply because we are what is known as rock logged or dirt logged on our build site. Um, and so they are working as much as they can given the fact that this is the rainy season for us and it's like they have a beautiful day and then for two days it'll rain and then a beautiful day and two days it'll rain and you can't really move dirt and rock in the rain. So we're going to post up a quick little video for you guys just as an update so that you see what's going on. But Evan and I will be back later this weekend to do kind of the Q&A to give you updates on other things that are going on with our project. Like we picked out appliances, we have made some decisions about um, our entry stairway, our retaining wall and our driveway materials and so we'll talk to you guys about those as well and then just kind of give you an update on the overall project so i just wanted to jump in give you this little intro i'll pop evan's um video from site from the site about a week and a half ago in behind this and you guys will get a quick little update but we'll be back later on this weekend with more i want to say hi case say hi everybody hi youtube all right, we'll see you guys soon. So as you can see, the process tour, um, you might be asking why haven't y'all put up videos in a while? Well, we started digging, we dug into the foundation, and then as you can see, we got rocked. So all these rocks you see right here, all come out of the ground. All that rock was in the ground. So definitely gonna be making some calls if anybody needs rock for landscapes, any of our neighbors need rock, we definitely gonna be giving out rock. But you can see right here where the, uh, backhoe is the excavator in there um you know i'll try to bird's eye it a little bit but that's the foundation um, we got a big mound of dirt back here so a little bit of topsoil back as well as excavation dirt so this is the back of the lot that i'm walking toward just watching to make sure i uh stay off you know where we are and then you can see over here this big front mound this all came out of our ground folks so this is you see how much rock is in there even in the pow there like that's all rock right there so you know we got rocked you know stone cold stunner you know make all your stone and rock puns right here because they definitely apply you know what what's what's my grounds favorite wrestler the rock you know what my you know what my ground said to the excavator it said do you smell what the rock is cooking and then we had to get all kind of extra costs so you know kind of like the rock it's like how much you how much does it cost and you got to dig the foundation so he said well, I think we'd like to pay. It doesn't matter what you'd like to pay because we got to pay it because, you know, you got to dig. So lesson here is when you're doing your home site allowance costs, definitely, um, you know, allow if most excavators will have a clause in their contract about if they do run into shale and rock because they actually have to jackhammer that to get deep enough to build your foundation. But obviously your foundation got to be solid. You can see there, there's our foundation dig down there. So make sure you do put that in there and, you know, have that because, you know, like the rocks say, it doesn't matter what it costs. You got to build a foundation. It's got to be good. So footers are going to be going in next, but first we got to get this dirt all hauled out of here along with rocks. So we're going to talk about that in another video on rock haul itself and some options for that since we've had to. Um, but yeah, definitely Tashwire tip in your home site allowances, allow for dirt haul, allow extra for jackhammering. I know it might think paying money just to haul dirt and you know jackhammer but you really need to because you see how much dirt and rock came out of this ground they actually said our excavator that this was the biggest that they've ever seen so you know cue, cue the three pfd song it feels good it doesn't feel good to pay for all this rock but you got to build the foundation solid so yep that's what happened we got rocked it's like it looks like the trash heap from fraggle rock wonder if I talk to it if it'll give me wisdom on how to finish the house. Shout out to my Fraggle Rock fans. Yeah. Show what up, R&B.